guys, Crusader here. We're back on some more Fallout 4 Medieval run. So if you guys are just joining us on this little venture... Mm, excuse me. The rules are pretty simple. I am not allowing myself to use, keyword use, any firearms. That doesn't mean that I'm not allowed to pick them up and sell them for caps. I can do that. I can sell the ammo. I got a bunch sitting in uh, the... Uh, dresser back in my old bedroom. We're gonna kinda continue on here back over to Diamond City. Now I've done a little bit of leveling up. I've done a lot of exploring actually. I've done a little bit of killing things here and there. I went over to Pikmin's gallery so I can pick up the Pikmin blade really quick. Uh, needless to say this thing's overpowered. It is beyond overpowered. Right into a death claw, went into sneak, popped a bit of psycho, went in for the three times uh, damage to ninja, rank one. Thing didn't even stand up to one hit, just flew right above my head with rad dog physics. Let's make our way over to Diamond City. Or not Diamond City. Yeah, Diamond City. <laughs> I don't know why I thought it was something else. Oh, there's the iBot for... Polymer... Tech... I don't know. Okay, let's get this going. How you doing? Well, of course. I just got here, but yeah. We're just gonna skip dialogue, we know what's going on. It's not, uh, it's not Danny's fault, it's a scummy boss. It's so sad that like, she gets treated so terribly. Piper, who let you back inside? No, no, no. I You're gonna deal with me. To keep that gate shut. You devious, rabble rousing slander. The level of dishonesty in that. Hey, hey, hey. I'll have that critter scrapped her parts. Yeah, and I'll get her a new one. Yeah, you're full of it. Go away. This hasn't been the friendliest welcome. He's got you there, my I appreciate them actually allowing you to go and just, uh... Just looking for something? Oh, uh, your business. That's my business. Oh, whatever you need to bother with the Diamond City security for Yeah. Enough of this, Piper. From now on, consider you and that little sister of yours on notice. Yeah, keep talking, McDonough. That's all you're good for. Mmm, right. a big Diamond City welcome from the mayor. Do you feel honored yet? Look, I gotta go get settled in, but, uh, stop by my office. I have an idea for an article you would be perfect for. And we'll start on Story of the Century. So anyway, uh, I did quite a bit of exploring. We leveled up several times over, so I'm not really afraid of death claws anymore. Especially wielding Pikmin's blade. Where's Danny boy? Where are you, buddy? Hey. You're that traitor Piper was talking. So it tells me she's pulled the ball over my eyes again. Right? Yeah, she did. I'm sorry. I didn't need to lie, honestly. It all just happened so fast. Nah, I'm not gonna answer you, cause you're frick mo frickin' cut you apart. Your boss is scummy enough. Oh well. Oh well, oh well. 
so with the level ups, I've actually managed to get myself up to level 3 for Sneak, which is really nice, so I no longer set out floor mines anymore. Uh, next rank of it doesn't come for a little while, so i got to start thinking about what to do next. Okay, we got Diamond City. Of course she is. Let's go ahead and come in here to Diamond City Market. Good to know that they're still working. Okay. Actually, that's kind of cool looking. Huh? That's the actual press she's referring to. That's actually pretty cool looking. It's very true. Alright, let's go do the interview really quickly here. I'm just going to kind of skip to the dialogue. And we'll go and rescue Nick. Glad you dropped by. Mm hmm. Yeah. Look, I'm just going to say it. Uh huh. So here's the deal. You do that, and you do that. Let's do it. Good. I mean, it, it so doesn't I'm hurt for box. experience. Well. Yes. <laughs> so you've seen the top. That's now the uh, big question. Yeah, well, we'll be kind of. I lost him. Okay. What's the name? Okay, fine. I didn't know. That. Wasn't too sure she wasn't gonna go and press a little bit, but she's pressing. We know the ending to it, but we're not sure at this point. I don't know. Becomes a companion now. Really don't need her at this point. Oh, we can take the old can. All right, let's go and murder some triggermen here while we're going to go rescue Nikki boy. Whoa, whoa, hey, hey, hey! What have you done with the real Brian? Where's my brother? I swear I'm not a sin. Don't shoot for God's sake. Put the gun down now. He's a Sith. He'll kill us all. Whoa, Kyle. whoa. Whoa. Okay. Show's over. There are no Sins in Diamond City. Hear me? Too close. Yikes. Alright. Uh, oh, where'd he go? <laughs> oh, that's funny. I can still take the trip, but I still get experience out of it. Hmm. Alright, let's go talk to Ellie really quick just to get this going. Okay. Okay, so that triggers the Freedom Trail. I'll do that afterwards. I'll do that in the next episode. Something wrong. Hi, Ellie. Spray coming in from the rain. Made you too late. Uh huh. Well. Wait. Me? No. Well, that's. This gets her to talk without even having to pass any speech check. Don't worry. There's an old fault. All right. Well, I'll find. Thank you. Uh -huh. Nick should be using the spot. Yes, he is. And during this run, I'm going to take him along to Far Harbor. I'm not going to be taking the uh, the Love Wanderer perk. There's really no point. In taking it, to be perfectly honest, it just makes no difference, really. All right, going to take care of unlucky Valentine real fast. 
And actually, I can just teleport straight to the railroad really quick, because I already discovered the old North Church already. Okay, so you're out that direction, out towards, uh... Out towards Bunker Hill and Pickman's Gallery and all that mess. So really, I'm actually having a blast on this melee-only character. I didn't know, I knew that lucky, that luck builds and critical builds were incredibly powerful. Of course, the sniper builds are always powerful, but I never figured that uh, melee would be super powerful, because you can only go so far into specifics. Alright, so let's go on. Ba-ba-ba-ba-ba. Oh, a real Boston accent, too. <laughs> nah, it's just not, but I don't need to take that sucker down. Be sure that everyone knows what the heck Pikmin's Blade is, but if you happen to not know what it is, it's a combat knife that's been serrated and has the stealth perk to it. Mm, excuse me. But it also has a legendary effect on it that tacks on an additional 25 points of bleed damage. So you hit the you hit your target once, it he starts to bleed and his like uh, what is it? His mm, mm hmm health bar. If I can remember the word for it. Starts going down. Subsequent hits actually just go down even faster. And faster. I'll show you guys on the uh, trigger end when I'm coming through oh, I need to look at something real fast. Next level, ah, dang, it's not until 15, 23, 18, oh, 16 for that. But, yeah, because I really don't need the Lone Wanderer perk, to be perfectly honest. I mean, granted, at the end of it, I'll wait, I would have to dump an extra thing into Charisma. Yeah, you take 15% less damage, carry weight increase 30% to 100, 25% extra, and a 25 action points. Nah. I mean, to be honest, that's not really all that great. Personally, to me, that's just not something that's more worth it to. You can get strong back and probably do better. Almost. Alright, so here's a wild mongrel. We'll we'll test out. I'll show you guys how Pitman's blade works. Hi guys. How you doing? Oh, there's a Mongol Alpha I can't reach him. Ow. Yeah, there goes the health bar. Just completely depletes by the time. <laughs> Oh, I didn't do any cooking. I should have did a lot of cooking. I got a bunch of meat sitting in my inventory. I didn't cook. So I'm just going to go straight down the middle of it. I don't think there's anything. I'm coming up to Swan's Pond? No, I thought that was further over. That can't be right. Unless I have my area wrong. Oh, well, there's Hertz Comics. So, yeah, I guess we are that close to... Huh. Interesting. I didn't think we were that close to Swan's Pond. Frag grenade, frag mines. Even though I'm not taking the uh, in spawn spawn. Even though I'm not taking the demolitions expert, which requires, which is was it five in perception? Even having the perception bobblehead, I still need to go and like 
dump two additional levels into it just to be able to get the first section of it. Ooh, super mutant. Can I? Ah, I can't blitz him. Why? Ah, there he goes. Ah, the four and a half times X damage. Oh, it's so beautiful to see. Uh, what's that? Your death. Oh, what? Ah. Guts around. He's right. Oh no, there's a window in front of it. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> About to die. That's not about to happen, huh? That would not be good. When in doubt, jet up. You're dead. You're dead. You're dead. It's like, come on, bleed damage. Whoa, hello. Let's grab a good neighbor. While we're on the trail. And it's on the way. It's not really all that far away from where Nikki's at anyway. Even though Nick's place is a little bit of a dungeon crawler. Just trying to get to him. Oh, I even ran across my very first uh, Super Mutant Suicider. I actually got a nice little strategy for him now. If I can sneak up on top of him and just kill him, I don't have to worry about it. Hey, hold up there. First time you could neighbor. Really? I know what your story is. Yeah, I don't put up with you. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> See you later, Hancock. I'll be doing the silver shot stuff as a spare side mission type of thing. It took about two episodes during my gun run to do it. I don't want to kind of clog things up because I enjoy doing that quest line. It's just it doesn't really help very much having to stop. Oh, wife just walked in. Hello. What's your plan? What's all that for? Nerd. Oh, come on already. Load. Nerd just wants to piss you off. Yeah. <coughs> That's a big. <laughs>